A tuition increase and an update in COVID-19 policy are some of the things Indiana State University students can expect in the fall semester. Sherry McBroom explains what new changes are in the works and what students can look forward to in August. Sherry. Mike, ISU Director of University Communications says the university is excited to welcome students back for what they hope will be a normal semester. One of the main topics of discussion was the university not mandating the COVID-19 vaccination. Through that, they will continue to strongly encourage the vaccination. They will in the meantime ask students and employees to voluntarily provide proof of their vaccination online. ISU alumnus Dr. Kenneth L. Smith gives the university $1 million to honor his late wife and support scholarships in accounting, economics, finance, and history. In honor of the gift, the ISU Board of Trustees approved the naming of the Kenneth L. Smith and Teresa Catherine Klein Smith Magna Carta courtroom in the College of Business. Tuition will be raised slightly beginning this fall, but Mark Alicia, Director of University Communications, says their tuition still lower than most public four-year institutions across the state. Alicia says with all these changes, the most exciting thing is hopefully being able to have a normal semester beginning this fall. We are really happy that we are going to be returning to something, if not completely normal, then close to normal. We're going to have all of the campus events, we're going to have homecoming, we're going to have our other campus traditions, we're going to be together for gatherings. It's going to be terrific. Alicia says besides providing an excellent education, being able to hopefully give their students the best college experience is what it's all about.